Well, the important thing from their point of view is, I mean, we've literally lost a couple of big players through uh, through injury. I mean, that's you just hope that by the time we got there, you got a full squad to pick from, and they're playing football twice a week from now to then. So that'll be the main, main issue from their point of view, trying to stay clear of injury. I mean, you don't think about it, but uh, it's so important for us with, with small squads to to, uh, to keep everybody fit. Both teams have done unbelievable to qualify. Whenever you look at uh, where we've come from. In my time, we never managed to, to qualify a European Championship, made two World Cups, 82 and 86, but uh, this is a one-off as well. well. So it's absolutely brilliant that the boys are in the, in the, in the competition. Really tough uh, section, no easy games, is it? But uh, we have got a particularly tough uh, games with uh, West Germany, but Germany, Poland, so it's going to be really tough, but I think whatever the do hopefully they'll go and just give a good current themselves and and uh, hopefully we can maybe make the next round. We went out and had a for the first World Cup we went to Brighton for two or three weeks before we, we actually went into Spain and the same in uh, for in in Mexico we went to America for a couple of weeks to get acclimatised and uh, then moved into into Mexico. So the preparation that was brilliant for oh, so long ago. <laughs> Well, without a doubt, I mean, for me, the, the great thing was in Spain, 82, was beating the host nation. I mean, I think leading up to it, we'd done really well through the first match against Yugoslavia, and then Honduras, give, they give us the toughest match, and we're going into the last match then uh, against against Spain. Hoping to get something out of that, I think quite a few of the boys had the bags packed as well, ready to go home the next day, and somehow went out in the night and beat beat Spain 1-0 goal from my mate Jerry Armstrong, absolutely brilliant, great memories.